or if there is a difference, I don't know. <laughs> In ADN's game. Hey, Hobo, thank you for the host. <sighs> Today's been trouble yourself not with the cost of this crusade. I should remember not to talk yes, about this. Noble end affords you broad tolerance in your choice of means. <laughs> Thank you for the host, he's so derp and hobo. <laughs> but uh what was I saying again? Or I kind of forgot my train of thought when the narrator interrupted and the host came on. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, we got... We got some stuff to work on. So I believe that we were planning on doing the Lost and Found here. Or the quest to get the event for Lost and Found for a free upgrade. If I double check, uh... Yeah, I already used it earlier. Alright, so then, what's the plan? Most people should be out. I believe I don't have enough to get... Actually, wait. Hmm. Oh, all right, so I can still heal Apache and uh, the Jester here. Okay, okay. So wait, what's that summer? Job recruiters like that don't really exist in where, where you are in your current on your own for finding a job. You try to get an appointment, but then they just referred you to a website with general info that didn't do much for you. Ah, uh, that sucks. At least with the recruitment agency that I was talking to, they sound or they, they sounded pretty helpful and uh, pretty much got their job done. So well, you know, setting up the or being the middleman was setting up the interview and everything. And it's like, okay, simple enough. So yeah, I'm not sure how bad it is over where you are though. That that kind of sucks though from what you're telling me though. But uh, anyway, it's back to this. What are we doing? Let's increase stress recovery. We don't need to increase it, but the treatment is all the way up here, and I want to save. Hmm. Actually, wait. Didn't I? Didn't I get something earlier? No. Wait. 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 What was it that I? was thinking about hmm I guess I was still thinking about getting the puppet theater and the sanguine uh, vintners hmm oh wait, it's nice so you're gonna get some hot cocoa and stuff all right just enjoy that hot cocoa hmm Actually, I think if we're gonna go in with the crew again in the in the Crimson Court, I guess I can save my money since we can stress heal with Patchy, because the Flagellant can stress heal itself relatively easily, as well as buffing speed if we have room to do that as well. Oh yeah, wait, I think. Uh, I think I wanted to put some people in the- oh, right. <laughs> oh yeah, wait, I'm just wondering, uh, let me double check something about the Flagellant. Does the Flagellant have any specific, like, I forget, does the Flagellant have, like, 0% virtue chance for that special, uh, affliction or what? Let me see, I forget. Uh... It doesn't mention anything about negative stuff with, uh, what was it? Negative stuff with Virtue Chance, I believe. 
Okay, let me check. Uh, virtue. Is there any? Let me see. Is there any different than? Uh. No, I don't see anything in the wiki that mentions the Flagellant having any difference with Virtue stuff compared to other classes. It's just the Rapturous Affliction that's unique to it. Yeah, yeah so I gotta go take off Mercutio. Last 5% off of our low base chance already is pretty bad. Even though Rapturous could be good, it might hurt more than not, because... Rapturous does a lot of things to your own teammates, if I remember correctly. Also, Torn Rotator. We do not want to subtract damage from our finale. No, 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 no. Finale has been saving my butt for... Er, has saved my butt countless times. Uh, anything? Actually, anything I can sell? Let me see. Did I equip everyone already? Yes, I did. Let me see. I don't think I can really... Or I don't really have room to sell much. Yeah, I really don't have room to sell much aside from... I don't know. I can't really find anything. Okay, so I think I'll save on my heirloom stuff for the districts at this point. Let's go focus on... Getting this dungeon done. And I believe everyone's skills are pretty good for the most part. Actually, maybe I should level up the Vestal Stun. Even though I've subtracted it already, you know, with the Sacred Scroll. You gotta keep it up. So it at least works when you desperately wanted to hopefully okay so this is a medium we're gonna need usually 20 is a fair amount we can bring this much uh let me see bleeding no well blights usually come from Actually, to be honest, we haven't really fa encountered too many enemies that blight, right? Just the sea maggots. Let me see, sea maggots. In case things get bad, we have the Crimson Court things that spew out puke for blighting. The maggot, Crimson Court thing. Uh, any fish in particular? No, it's usually bleed more often than not. I think I'll take three bandages in case it bleeds get real bad. I'll have to tank through it with some of them. And uh, if it's something that I can't deal with, like a bleed put putting me at death's door, then I'll use it or something. And I think I'll want two medicinal herbs. One for probably opening up a fish corpse. Actually, no, maybe two. Two for fish corpses. And one for eerie coral. And actually, now that I think about it, if it's a medium cove, we might want to bring a fourth shovel. Maybe fifth? Nah, that might be too much. Because they're the oysters we can hold open, or... Actually, no, no. I can bring a fish shovel specifically for barnacle chests. And because it's not a, a last one, we can break this... We can free up this inventory slot real quick. And I think I'll bring two skeleton keys. Because usually... There's not that many treasure fights, or as many treasure fights as I would like. Famous last words before we find like three treasure rooms and a secret door, and I'm like, oh god. And I think I'll skimp out a tiny bit and make sure I use Dazzling Light more often to raise up torch levels. 
Actually, hell, maybe skimp on on it even more. And because we have two Crimson Cursed people, one of who is wasting away currently, I'll probably take five just as a precaution. And then afterwards. That's about it, really. So, in terms of skill loadouts. I definitely have to be careful with the Abomination. Actually, no way. Can I just move the Abomination to E3? Yeah, you know what? I should be doing that. So, next time I'll flip them, flip them back. So now, I think I'll take Puncture because of those Guardian things that can guard uh, other allies. The, what, was, what were they called? The boar or something? I think expose because those shamans or oracles tend to stealth. And then probably serpent's way to ward off extra damage should I become desperate. I think that's good. And we're set. Recover these lost shipments of rarities, uh. that we may prevent them from falling into even less scrupulous hands. Uh. Let me see. Kirio, 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 quest location. Kirio, Kirio, nothing, nothing. Kirio, Kirio, room battle with Kirio. Okay, so that means the last ancestor relic. The last ancestor relics would be within these final stretches here. So I think if I had to lay this out, because I think I can afford to do some battles, get curios, and move back. To be honest, and I think I can afford the shovel. So I move. Oh, actually. Mm. Nah, but it is potential for loot, and I need every scrap. Yeah, I think going up, down to the southern part, and wrapping around up and back would be nice. Or would be preferable, maybe. Yeah, let's go do that. But before we head out, I need to rearrange some people. Uh, Alright, I, th I think that's plenty good. Alright, what's our first curio of this dungeon? Oh. <sighs> Here we go again. I think I want to give Summer a good chance for something good, so... I'm sorry if you get anything bad, Summer. Yes! On guard. Oh! Uh, I would have preferred if it was luminous since it's a more permanent bonus, but I mean, I can't complain about first turn. Alright. Alright, pretty good. Pretty good. I'll take it. Nothing but fish. Uh, let's see, who's gonna have trouble hitting what? So the Vestal can hit the back, can hit the back. I think I might need to use a, uh, oh, right, right, this is the one time I don't have Retribution. <laughs> okay, okay, so we'll take this one at a time from the front, maybe. Or middle? Because we can hit the middle and then the Abomination can puke and then Man at Arms go on front, stun the front too. Destroy. Or we can just crit it and forget about it. Hmm, actually if we're gonna... 
Dude, would I be better double stunning? I think that would be more manageable, to be honest. Ah, damn it. That's the turn. Okay, even 8 speed, that means they rolled higher on the initiative. Possibly kill. Their formation yeah. is broken. Maintain the offensive. And I think. Mm. We can do this again just to raise the torch level. It's, it's gonna be a low stun chance, but we got it anyways. Alright, we raised it back to 100%. That's nice. Not, that's not nice. Made clear. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Alright, so I think if we're in the front... Maybe I'll take out Defender and get Retribution. Oh god. I'll be quiet, old man. Decimated. Sit down. Ooh, that is some pretty mean damage, though. is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Ah! Confidence <laughs> surges as the enemy crumbles. Okay, now we just need to get our value out of this by getting hit one more time with the man-at-arms. In Radiance, may we find victory. Yeah, there's that value. Oh, never mind. Screw it. Oh my god, yeah. Freaking retribution. Ugh. Fine, fine. You gotta do things the old fashioned way. A faint hope blossoms. And you're stunned, so we can just use absolution here. Just stop down to zero. Continue the onslaught. Destroy. Them all. Ooh, blood charm. That's neat, I guess. Um, uh, what do I did? Think I might. Mm, do I really need a solo bleed resist item though? Uh, I mean, uh, uh. um. Venom. Yeah, I think the anti venom should go. I didn't think I'd be ditching it this soon, but sure. Although, although it's only a hundred gold. If it was a bigger stack, then I'd keep it. But yeah, I think that's fine. Ah, fish carcass. Uh, do I want to do that now, though? I think I'll wait for it.
Because I do not want to get backtrack stress. Oh yeah, there's no fight here, so... Uh, I guess we do gotta use this anyways. Oh, okay, okay. What is it? <laughs> more anti-venom. Oh boy. And more gold. I know the citron's worth more than this, but the gold stack's higher. Hmm. Let me reorganize some stuff. I think, uh... Yeah, you know what, maybe... Uh, taking a second stack of shovels is a mistake. Oh well. Ah! Nice. So... Winded, Night Blindness, Revolution, Dead Hitter, Only Campbell. Ah! Uh, may not meditate, may not pray. Nah, no, that's just stress treatment though. I think maybe I might get value out of curing the Abomination here. When did Quirk remove? That's nice. Okay, so if, if the Abomination gets hit low, won't lose out on speed anymore. Another Mariner? Another misfortune. Let's see, Torch level is 50-50 almost. Got another stealth. Oh yeah, wait, why did I take, uh... Why did I take Twilight, er, no, no, Expose on Summer? I forgot. Ignore stealth. I'm, I'm a dummy. Oop. Ah, low roll. We got plenty of stuff to go, so I think. I think maybe Retribution. And then probably single heal the Man at Arms since he's, he hopefully will tank a couple hits. Mm. Okay, one. That balances out a tiny bit. And the second hit. Nah, you're gonna guard. Alright, so I think. We got end this guy first. can guard when we repose, so that's really nice. Buff up everyone. I think I want to go... This guy is going to die due to the Blight. And we really need to heal these two, so... I think, uh... Two Brick has less health. I know the percentages are off, but... Gently. Look this at the raw numbers. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, I resisted that. Ah, oh, that was a low chance. Uh, also, how about this one? Much better. And back to single healing. A momentary abatement. I feel like maybe I should have taken the tough ring, but I didn't want to lower what little damage the Man at Arms has. The Man at Arms has good utility, but no damage to balance it out well. A trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. Alright, so I think I can skip on the portrait, the trinket. 
I'm still banking on one more coral, because look at all this. Also, quest location right here. Because I'm trying to make sure I activate several curios to at least chip away at my inventory before I pick stuff up. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, so what's the plan? Yeah, I think I just ditched this. They're, they're not really worth much. Ooh! I think. I have a virus. Nah, it's just a cough, man. It's not like it's anime or TV show or something where t someone coughs, you know they're gonna die. It's like, like, our everyday lives, like, cough, cough, it's like, ah, whatever, I'll drink some water, just something. And it's like, ah, okay, just fine. And like, in any, in any show or story, a, even the slightest sniffle means death. And it's like, oh god. Aw, oh, low roll. The Japanese flu. <laughs> I wonder. Nah. Rock Hill? Hmm. Okay. And we could stun, but I would want more heals out. Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. I think I'll puke on both. Bear with the stun next turn from the jellyfish. I want to give myself a chip tea because I'm also hungry as hell for some reason despite having dinner earlier. While I wait for the turn to play out in its own. And now the shield breaker. Oh, what are you going to do? Oops. Damn it. Hmm. Does that mean I need a stun? I, I can deal with the stun. It's this guy that I'm worried about. Nice. <laughs> God damn it, Hobo. There's some other good quotes too, or actually, I remember Origami had some quotes, but I'm not sure if he still has has it somewhere when he, I think when he tried out a bot or something like that, if I remember correctly. Uh, I forgot how the first one went. <laughs> this I can turn this off. Nah, nah, we, we, we can keep the, the quotes. They're silly fun. Um, uh, Cress. Uh, no one's real hurt. That doesn't matter. Anti venom. Anti venom. Because we can get closer to our 200 Cress. Any future battles coming up? Not really. Uh, sure. I don't have any mods. Uh, does anyone else want to be a mod? <laughs> uh, some people have modded. Yeah, <laughs> some people aren't here regularly. Oh, oh, there's a shovel finally. Hmm. Yeah, girl. Mm. I'd bust it open right now, though. Mm. I think I'll hold off on it. Okay, Sarah, hold on. There you go, Sarah. Does anyone else want to be a mod? 
Wait, 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 wait. We should. We go back to this part here. Ah, uh, no, 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 not that one. Not yet, not yet. Ah, damn it. I've been wandering around too much. Food check already. Take all. Uh, I guess we got no point. Or uh, no other option but to take this. Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Hmm. I guess the portrait because we could still make good use from the bandages. Still a chance to be bled. Yeah, I think that'll do. I'm still waiting on that next thing of Eerie Coral, even though it's a low spawn. Low spawn chance, probably. Oh yeah, wait, I need to take this off. I think I'll take Impale and this. We can bust that open. What'll it be? Some blood, and we can take everything but the citron. I know, backtracking stress, but whatever. And... Who do we want to get a positive quirk? How about... The Abomination. Yeah. Two for two. Stout, that is... Yeah. Useless. Wait, I forgot. Was anyone light sensitive? Nah, not really. Mm. Actually, we still have a ways to go. Maybe I can hold off on it. Another one falls. Well, use their positive quirks when they get replaced by a crappy one later. Yeah, but uh, that's why on certain ones we make sure to lock in certain ones that are good. So if and when I can, I'll try to lock in Faded. Because anything to offset bad accuracy is a godsend. Stuff stuff with permanent and consistent bonuses like... Uh, what was it? It's not on here, but tough. 10% HP at all times. Or... Bonus HP, that would be pretty nice. I might think about locking in qu quick reflexes for two speed. And that's pretty important to uh, get a good turn order or you get stunned to hell or something. So basically quirks like that are worth locking in. Other ones, like there are some useful stuff like let's say on guard. But like, it, I'm fine with this being replaced to be fairly honest, because th like after this works for one round, it's a dud. It does nothing, so there's no point. Hey, Patchy, how are you doing? A dud. <laughs> Uh, if only my original Xbox uh, was working, I can play Metal Gear Solid 2. <laughs> that would be pretty fun. Like, there's like a lot of Xbox games my brother and I like uh, got together, but then uh, because the Xbox slowly broke down over the years, it's basically a brick at this point. I never got to play MGS2 because my brother, when I was like, watching him play at the time never let me try it out. Man. Although, like, I could have, you know, like, played it without him and all, but, like, they were. Well, actually, I forgot why, but I think it was other games and, like, just, like, me not 
understanding MGS at the time because I was pretty young and new to Metal Gear stuff. So I, I could see that there's a lot of stuff going on in MGS games and I was like uh, kind of hoping I could tag along with my brother to help me to help guide me through uh, while trying it out but yeah that's kind of unfortunate though. The lolly lule low. <laughs> Wait. Oh, you're the brother hogging the PS2. Wow. <laughs> uh, let's see. Yes, stun resist. Stun the stunner. Ah, sure. Oh, it worked. You only played the first Metal Gear Solid? Uh, I've seen playthroughs of. Pretty much all of the Metal Gear Solid games. I really uh, cool to watch. Is the weapon that cuts on its own. Cause like you know, I had MGS2 at the time. Uh, I think by the time I finally got around to thinking about playing MGS2, that was around the year the Xbox started breaking down a lot more often. Cause I remember when I was trying to play stuff like. Like Merwind on Xbox because it was before like my brother and I, or before I got this for PC, like way before I got on a PC. Like the load times and just like freezing that was going on with the Xbox. Like yeah, we weren't gonna do anything with this anymore. <laughs> Oh, you got surprised with the whole Psycho Mantis thing? Yeah, when I looked at that, like, that was, that was pretty cool and outside the box. Your PS2's probably broken, but your PS1's working like new. <laughs> ah, you're craving now, that's not good. Oh, money! Success so clearly in view, or is it merely a trick of the uh, night? Lead resist gotta go. I think that maybe. Hmm. Maybe bandages gotta go. How about deeds? It would be nice if I got them, but it's not. It's not important. Your PS2 eventually broke down before it could barely read uh, this. Us. Ah, oh, that's bad. Or, I'm sad, Sarah. You still have your PS2 hobo? Huh. I feel like... I feel like I really missed out on a lot of... PS2 stuff. Because, like, I think I made the decision to go for, uh... <gasps> what was it? The... GameCube? I don't have fun with the GameCube, it's just... There's a lot of cool... PS2 stuff that I kind of wish I got my hands on. Like, the Jack and Daxter games, when I visited my cousin at the time. Some, I believe some Ace Combat games, I believe. Armor Core. Um... What was it? There were some other neat PS2 games that I played on my cousins a while ago. Or, yeah, several, several years ago. Um, uh, what was it? Oh, yeah, it, Final Fantasy X. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah, there was a, like, my... I think when I was visiting, like, uh, or 
I'm with my mom one time when visiting while she was visiting her friend or something at her house. I was kind of playing with uh, with my like mom's friends like what was it son and played some Devil May Cry three I think and got bodied because I don't know how Dev I didn't know how Devil May Cry played at the time and I died at the first boss. So there was that. Final Fantasy friend rooting. Uh, no, my cousin did not have uh, Final Fantasy twelve. Uh, like actually, like he was kind of restricted on a lot of games at one point because super strict Asian parenting, and at a certain point, like basically limited his free time with games and stuff to like one or two hours per day at most and got real pissy like if he wasn't studying or anything else or doing something quote-unquote productive after that so like, i wouldn't be surprised if i heard that like his mom probably gave away or tossed away the ps2 or all that stuff which frustrates me but like yeah I uh, kind of feel bad for my cousin because I didn't hear like every now and then my cousin's mom yelling at him to get back to studying or some other productive things, quote unquote. So even though like it was kind of fun hanging out with my cousin and all, yeah, it just really sucks that this kind of stuff, or he's, he's kind of had to be brought up like that with such a strict like management of his time I guess like, I'm not sure if he wanted to or not, but I felt like he was forced to practice, you know like, if you're to look at stereotypical like, strict Asian parenting, you gotta practice the piano, gotta be a doctor, uh so on and so forth like super tight restrictions on when he can play games or go on the computer and among other things so yeah it was pretty uh, kind of like a huge like bummer anytime like, uh, oh, you're gonna heal you piece of. Mm. God damn it. But, uh, yeah, things kinda sucked at my cousin's house. Studying the female anatomy. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, Cav. Yeah, if you didn't have a mom and dad like that. Yeah, I'm kind of jealous of some of my friends who've had parents, some parents who were a little more laid back than than others. Do it. You're already dead. Like, or I don't know. Uh, actually, I had something else to say, but I don't remember how I was gonna word it. <laughs> Eradicated. Wait. Speaking of friend, Viera is apparently gonna be a new race in Final Fantasy XIV. Huh. Irresistant. Yes, then again. Oh, oh, you got slam. Oh my god, that was a far slam back. Obliterated.
Wait, your mom tried to tell you to do the certain times thing? Ah. Yeah, like, it just really sucks that, like... Impressive. Like, on one hand, it's understandable that, like, they would want to make sure that we don't go too far with, like, playing games and all that stuff and such, but, like... Then, but, but being too restricted to the point where... Like, we're just not having fun with our day and having too much, like, control, I guess, put over, like, our free time. Like, then it just keeps adding to the problem and then say, why, why, or how come you're like this? It's like, well, can you think about what you've been doing for the past couple years? Hello? A momentary abatement. Could be now in Gotcha Hell. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like you weren't disciplined enough. I barely have self control, especially on buying stuff. It's not that bad, right, Ova? Oh, hey, look, another figure's on sale. Like, oh, my wallet. <laughs> I don't know. Sub the three streamers. Oh, no. <laughs> hmm. Actually, wait, hold on. No, actually, if my hunch is right, and this could be another quest location thing, I could hold off on shovel usage and circle back. Yeah, I think I'll circle back. I'll grab that loot later. Animal carcass. We'll circle back. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Sub to 25 streamers, Jesus. Hmm, you're stunned. Illuminate. Uh, I don't think illuminate would matter, but ah, uh, sure. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Vulnerable to impulse buying like scam gotchas. <laughs> How many of us have fallen victim to the, to the scam gotcha? Oh, come on! No! Gotcha is eternal. <laughs> play games but there's always a scam to it or yeah pretty much I mean like well I mean businesses and devs gotta make money somehow they're gonna 
have a free to play game. I mean, that's understandable. But yeah, with the malicious practices though, I, I, I get that though. The kind that kind of preys on people with uh, very bad habits. Oh! I should really buff up. Not EA levels of scumbag though. <laughs> Compassion is a rarity in the fevered pitch of battle. Oh. The slow death. Unforeseen. Oh, this fight is taking forever. picture oh uh, uh, was it the boxing picture with like some guy who wailed and the guy who grinded up to where he got to <laughs> yeah that's really that's kind of microtransaction stuff in a nutshell Sanguination be considered a virtue. Mm. So emeralds bust. Uh, I think we can skip out on most of them at this point. I would like the money, but I don't know what to give up. We're gonna run out of space with these relics, and I haven't eaten my food yet. I could camp right now, but I, I prefer to camp when we get to this Kyrio, though. Hmm. Let me see. And I don't want to give up the crest because we're getting very close to getting a, a third district with 200 crests. Then and also I need bus if I'm gonna get the uh, vintner for making blood. I think... I think I might ditch the food and feed the rest to the... or to summer. It's gonna be risky because food checks, but... Hmm... I can replace the ruby, but hmm. Hmm. Or I can rest now. Beast for stress. Re no, that's a bit of a waste. Oh god, wait, this is actually tougher than I thought because management. Because there's still some fish carcasses I can. I can open up. And the keys... Uh, I mean, there's always a chance of a secret door. I also want to get rid of torches. But... Uh, I don't know I don't know about that. Because we still got a ways to walk. Actually, this is a very tough decision. Because we still have un uncharted territory that could need shovel use.
Um. Because the vendors we can ignore, obviously. Um. If I were to take the gold and the bust. Let me see. Hmm. Actually, how many fish carcasses? I think there's probably at least one that I skipped over. One that I skipped over. Or I could open a fish carcass and get minimum loot, if there's a good chance. Although I think I might risk getting a disease if I remember correctly. Uh... Or I can just take none of these, but the bust, though. Hmm. Hey, Rill. How are you doing? Yeah, okay. I think for sure I'll probably ditch the gold. So, maybe get the bust instead. So if I were to get the bust... I would probably... Or actually... Maybe I could rest. No, but then we're... Then we're wasting torchlight. <sighs> Ugh. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I, I'm guessing I'll get rid of the medicinal herbs. Fine. Oh, that was stress relief. And stress added back because screw you craving. Oh my god, you are so picky. Fine, you be the one to move then. <laughs> Man. Well, at least we don't play tanker playing games. I mean, like, uh... Wait, what was that tank game called? World of Tanks? What was the plane game that you're talking about? I don't remember that one. Oh my god, shovel. Oh, hold off on that one. Ah! Oh. Ah, oh, that's just great. Just when we ditched all of our medicinal herbs. No scouting chance either. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. Hmm. Okay, here's the money problem again. Yeah, you know what? Screw it. We're we're go we're gonna go dark. Use the last level we have. Safety. Or I assume we're going dark, but let's see how long we can make this last because we still have the Vestal's uh, Dazzling Light and the Illumination to provide Torch. Although we don't really use this that much because of the fact that our Abomination's right here. Oh, we don't have it anymore. Ah, uh, fine. Nothing inside. And then this one was the barnacle. I think I'll just try to open this up normally because we still got a fair amount to go before we find an obstacle. Yeah, nothing. It would have been guaranteed if I used a shovel, but I didn't want to chance it. Sack is empty. Hey. Okay, you know what? Okay, if I get stressed out, I'm camping on the next room. Ooh, full stack. Ah, 
uh, not another trap. Uh, Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. Oh hey, we got a shovel back. Yeah, okay, maybe it's fair enough to this back now. Have to dish the portraits. Not much need and not much. Oh. <gasps> Thank God that there is a shovel inside that chest. <coughs> Excuse me. But that this was lucky. Oh. Oh my god. We ain't touching that. Driven luck. Uh, oh, thank god. Oh? Oh? Guess who kept their keys? Ah, uh, of course the quest location would be at the very end. Oh, wait. Kirio, Kirio, secret. Ah, nice. Great shot. Oh god. Yeah, good thing we didn't camp. Nasty gash. Resisted. Carried. <laughs> Look! Oh. Oh. Oh god. Ain't good. Oh, you resist too. World of Tanks and Water Thunder have real bad monetization schemes. Put you in you murder them. I'll put you in later, Patchy. Actually, I got an idea. Stun you. Oh, come on. How much is 130 minus... They, they keep resisting on a 15%. You've got to be kidding me. Try to remove the guard. Funny. No, that'll raise it up a bit. I think I can live with darkness a bit. Good day, Aww. Uh, come on. Bad positioning. Even worse. Terrible assault cannot be left unanswered. This is why I don't do dark runs. Masterfully executed. This is why I despise Dark Run so, so much. And hell, this isn't even like pitch black. No, that's not gonna kill. That was not gonna kill. Come on. Oh, don't you dare push the man at arms. Okay, thank god. There! No more stress. Mm. Uh. So you're stun resistant, you're not... Oh, 
Ooh. Wait, why do people play what games? Oh, like World of Tanks and stuff that's pay to win. Wait, they claim you don't need premium time to do well, but then this people are full of crap. Yeah, that could be it also, Patchy. Like, sometimes people failing to realize... Or failing to admit that they're being scammed by a game that they enjoy playing and still supporting it nevertheless. Or... Oh, I put in this much money, I, I gotta keep playing, man. Otherwise, like, I, I lose all my money and die and uh, all that other stuff I put into my account. Or, yeah, maybe just, like, time as well, like, in general. Like, I put this much time, I, if I quit, it's like, what was the point? Ah, oh, not a double bleed. Oh, thank god. This game gotcha money is the reason you still play. <laughs> Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Alright, we're going ham, we're having a feast. Alright, so then, anger management. Encourage. Those games are perfect for me to wail. I don't wail, and if I do spend, like, it would be over really long periods of time for very little. So yeah, psych up, nah. remove, oh wait, I can remove, nah, that's only one round though, that's not worth my time. Actually, I don't even have, uh, oh right, I don't even have any more stress healing, oh that sucks. Okay, so snake eyes, uh, I think, I think we can end it with the weapons practice maybe. Crit, 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 nice. And nighttime ambush, here we go. The way is lit, the path is clear. We require only the strength to follow it. A handsome reward for a task well performed. Fish carcass. I can't wait to get a disease. Nothing. Uh. Yeah, let's go get the chest now. So we can ditch this. That's a lot of money. I think I actually might have to end up ditching the bus at this point. Hmm. Yeah, look at all this money. Rows of, or er, stacks of gold. <clears throat> ah, hold on. Even though I'm drinking a decent amount of water, it feels like maybe I'm dressing my throat out too much. I don't know why. Anyways, uh, yeah, full stacks, we got the secret door, I think this is a full stack of emeralds, I think, a ruby, some good value right there, alright, gonna have to kiss those goodbye, unfortunately. Alright, is this going to be a room battle? Alright, 
And I'm not ditching the blood because I I need to not I I need to keep these badly. Mm. Okay, three bus versus no, uh, this is half a stack versus a full stack though. But crests are more common. Mm. Or I can ditch this short stack of eight hundred. Yeah, you know what? I think I'll dish the the short stack. All right. Now that was some value. Not to mention the event will trigger for a free upgrade. Even more value. Ruin scrounger replace unholy slayer. Eh. You got a disease. Oh. Bone death. Ah. Ah, that sucks. He was gift. Ah, no. You replaced your two speed with heals on camping, but you don't have any heals on camping. Bad humors. Ugh. Oh uh, no! Oh no! Scattering minus on range skills. That's not bad because no range skills. Gothic replace quick reflex. You son of a bitch! They replaced all of the quick reflexes for objectively worse works. I'm not gonna bring in a cultist with a vestal, and we lost speed on our abomination. Oh my god. <laughs>